Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host AMF1534 here. Welcome back to Let's Play some more Devil's Dare. And last time we got to fight the uh, the rehashed version of Baxter Stockton from uh, Turtles in Time, which was pretty cool. Uh-oh, what the hell? What is going on right now? Um, no? Why is this happening? Why? What in the... What in the name of creation is going on right now? I'm just stuck out here in empty space. There. Why? I'm hitting... I'm hitting left and he's still going that way. I, I actually have absolute... I... Oh. Why is that happening? Why is he doing that? I don't understand. That is... No! Don't go that way! God damn it. This is really annoying. And there's like nothing I uh, There's absolutely nothing I can do. It's it, I don't know why it's doing that. That doesn't make any sense. What the fuck is going on? Um So the only the only way that I can move left right now is by doing the dash. That's the only way. That is the absolute only way that I can go left right now. What an awful time for that to happen. Let's go. Can we can we go now? Thank you. So we had to go through a completely unnecessary thing to be able to do that. How retarded. Nothing like having a potential game-breaking glitch happen in the worst possible time that you could have it happen in. And I'm getting destroyed by these dogs. God, get the fuck out of here. Just for a second, you know? Getting so sick of you little fuck nuts. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. I don't even care. Oh, good. Actually, you know what? There's probably food in there. Yeah. I will take it. God, get. No! Yeah, how's about you just go? You know what? Just, just go. No, you're not gonna go? Alright. At least I can get this guy to go. I do like the idea that I don't necessarily have to uh, actually fight them. I can just knock them off the edge and everything's fine. Of course, though, once again, at the worst time, we get one of these guys coming in. Come on. Okay, here we go. Oh. We did get that fat guy caught in a loop. So it can happen. Who would have known? Huh. I did not know that's how that went down. I thought that you... It's just because I was getting a little bit too quick with the uh, with the combo on that. I was so I was so worried about actually, you know, doing things a certain way. There we go. Now we can get some food out of this. Oh, tight! Well, there we go, we got more food that we haven't picked up yet. There we go. Ah! Oh, boy. Yeah, the back to the, the whole thing about Hunger Games, though. It was super tight. Like, I, I, I knew that there was... I knew that there was a whole thing about, um... I knew there were, like, moments in there where they were... Oh, my God! Yeah, I didn't mean to do that. I mean, I, I kind of did. I definitely... I def- whoa. I definitely sort of meant to do that. Oh my god. Man, there is way too much testosterone in this one area. Um, but it was good though, like, I knew that there were some action sequences in there that, you know, because, I mean, the entire thing is based off of battle, more or less. But I didn't expect it to be as, as gruesome as it was. Like, it was- there were parts of that that were- that were really, really gruesome. Like, way hardcore. Like, there was a part where, like, you, like when the whole thing starts up, just people are getting their throats slit and getting, you know, knives and daggers shoved into them and people getting, you know, arrows right in the middle of the chest. Oh, shit. That's not good. Let's go. And then there's, uh, I think, I think probably my favorite one out of those, though, was, and it was something that was so simple. It was just an instance of 
uh, just this one girl just getting picked up pretty much and getting just bashed up against the the wall of this little like this little like uh like warehouse looking like base thing and it was gro like you could you could just like you could feel just the high octane pain that came out of that that was it huh oh i know what's going on Cowabunga. yeah number 10's coming up and it's gonna get serious i can i know what's going on i know what you're doing but yeah it was good and like just I don't know, it was it was a type of movie that I've never seen before. Like just like all of the all of the costume work that went into that, because like there was so much makeup and shit done in that, and like like all the infrastructure and just like all of the really cool little things that they put into it were all really cool. Oh hell yeah. That's that's exactly what's up. But hold on. Better question, why would they give us two of the same power-up available in here? That doesn't make much sense. Whatever, we'll take it. But yeah, it was just it was different. I like I really like the concept. Hey, it's Big Apple, but not necessarily at 3 a.m. So wait a minute. Maybe we're gonna fight Baxter Stockman again. Maybe that was his brother. Who knows? Maybe it wasn't his brother. Maybe that was him, and now we're just gonna fight him when he's extra pissed off. Maybe that's what it is. And I like that we're going the other direction for a change. That's kind of cool. Oh god. Oh my god. No! It's this guy! Oh my god. That's actually really awesome. I really like everything that's going on with this right now. That's really funny. Oh my god. Dude, his health bar is on some bullshit right now. Are you kidding me right now? So, hold on a second. How are we supposed to defend ourselves? Okay. But that, that doesn't necessarily help me out at all. Oh my god. Oh, that's how you do it. So that's how you hurt the man. I see what's up. Man, that is going to take a lot of time. And I mean a lot of time. But, yeah, it was just... it was, it was the, the whole concept of that movie is something that I really like. It, it, really? Oh boy. Man, that is going to be troublesome. Oh, perfect, yes. Slow combo, that's that's what does it. Woo! Yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna run away. Oh, he blew me away. Hey! Blow me to Bermuda! But, yeah, I, I like the whole idea of, like, you know, all the districts sacrificing one person of each gender and, you know, varying ages to, you know, fight and for your... for this whole thing. I don't know, I think it was cool. And I like the fact that... I think the, the craziest thing about that movie is the fact that, um... Oh, shit. I think the craziest thing about that movie is the fact that the people that are running that tournament can just change the environment whenever they fucking want to. Like, it's really messed up because it, like, it totally takes the element of fairness out of it completely. That's not what I wanted. That is not what I wanted at all, actually. And we don't have any food stuffs left here. But we can definitely get some. Oh. Okay, you know what? Here's our opportunity. Or not. Come on, come on. No! God damn it, I fucking hate these things. Of course it would be these things. Of all the things it could be, it had to be... Uh, had to be these things. Come on, thing. I need I need this to reload like now. Oh, well, I mean that's cool that you killed them all for me and everything, but that actually does not help me at all. Come on, come on. Here we go. Once again, that does not help me at all. It's just like they it, it's timed just perfectly so that I can't get my combo off. That's the worst part of this whole thing. Come on. Ah, oh, fuck. It's still quite the bummer that I can't, uh, that I can't jump. I, I have, I do have that one move. God, stop jumping the other way! God damn it! Jump towards the thing! 
Like, that's that's the thing that I'm trying to hit, is the big guy. I, I could care less about these little stupid things. I mean, obviously they're bad, and like, I, I'm supposed to do something about it. But this guy is definitely my focus, like, he's the guy that I want to kill. I mean, at this rate, it's gonna take us for fucking ever. But, hey, what do you do? Oh, God. Come on. Ah. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, that's that's fantastic. Yes, let's, let's constantly find a way to get ourselves hit. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, that kind of did. I mean, at least that actually registered that it hit him for a change. That little special move of ours. I, th I think that probably the most important thing that we've had happen for us so far was definitely the, uh... It was definitely this whole, uh, this whole thing with being able to recover HP. Like, that is absolutely the most, the single most important thing that we've had happen so far. Fuck you, you know? Oh my god. Let's go. Really? Yes, yes. Drop me in on that at the worst time. Come on, come on. And again, that did nothing. What a fucking waste of my time. Holy shit, this is, I mean, I'm probably not going about this necessarily the right way. Oh my god, thank you. Go, come on, come on. Come on. And that... Uh, I think the, the worst part about this fight is that it's just so damn tedious. Come on, come on, baby. Come on, baby! I kinda did a little bit. I mean, we're, we're slowly making progress. And I mean very slowly. Like, we're talking snail's pace progress right now. Come on, come on, baby. Come on. I'm going to kill you, Flyman! Kinda, maybe, I don't know. I mean, I definitely have plenty of money, but... That's only guaranteed for about probably four more revives until we're not going to be able to pull it off. Yeah, boy, that even our special move really doesn't hurt him even in that stage very much. That is that is a rough task. Oh my god, what a terrible Thing. At least we're able to recover three at a time. Like, if we were only recovering, like, one HP at a time, that would really be a pain in the ass. But the fact that it stalls at 21 or 22 also does not help matters much. Oh, there we go. That actually was really, really good timing for that. No, no, no. Oh, you fucker. No! I was hoping that I was going to have that thing timed out well enough that I could pull it off, but it did not look like it was going to happen. Come on! No! God damn it, I'm so close! If these stupid things would stop shooting their weird, cummy goo stuff out of their face at me, I'd probably be able to, you know, do more damage to him. Come on, come on. Here we go. Oh, we have heard him! Yes! You see? He's not a machine! He's a man! A very large man in a marshmallow suit! That's being controlled by a man with a fly head! Alright. I mean, I can't imagine... Maybe it was, though. Maybe that was the, the absolute final boss. In this retro-themed experience of ours. But let's see. Well, I'm gonna guess because they're showing me this that it's obviously not over yet. And... Ooh. You know what? Just in case. Just in case we totally screw it up. Do we do it? Impressive, puny humans. Impressive. Oh no, this is where he becomes a bastard. 
But you didn't think that killing everyone was the end game now, did you? That's merely a job for the casual gamers. A hero like you should set the bar higher. You know, like getting a high score, unlocking achievements that they never had back in those days, or maybe just saving this godforsaken world. Oh, you didn't know how? Well, well, that's where I come in. For the low, low price of $6,666, I am willing to reveal just that. So what say you? Well, I mean, I'm not really much of a betting man. Yes, I am. A wise choice indeed. Now listen carefully. To save the world, all you need to do is insert the following keys. Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, special, and attack. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, that didn't work? Of course not! This wasn't a game made by Konami, you bastards! If you want... wait. If you want me spit out all these delicious little... that didn't make any sense. If you want me spit out all these delicious little souls and bring them back to life, you will have to defeat me! Unfortunately, you are too broke to fight me now. Or am I? Oh, great. He's a fuck. He's the purple town tummy. <laughs> oh my god! You must be kidding me. I mean, so he's a mixture of the pink tele or the purple Teletubby mixed with the doll from Saw. That's great. <laughs> Vwee hee hee. Oh god, this is a mess. This is the last guy, huh? All right. To the moon. So somehow we're on the moon now. Oh boy. <laughs> Yeah, if you thought we were doing this in another episode, you were sadly mistaken, because we're doing it right here, right now. Actually, you know what? Just because this is more than likely going to take a pretty long time, we'll, we'll actually save it for, for another episode, because this is probably the... I mean, this is the last boss, so... You know what, I didn't realize how long it had taken us, by the way, too. That's part of it. So, when we come back on what may be the final episode of Let's Play Devil's Dare, we are going to the moon to fight the Teletubby Saw doll spawn of Satan guy that's wearing a suit with weird red wings. So, you guys take it easy, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.